Welcome back to another video. So today we'll be taking a look at ARK Invest and their penny stock that they're aggressively buying. So ARK Invest, if you guys don't know, uh, is run by Kathy Wood, a very well-respected investor. And they basically look for innovative and disruptive companies in uh, emerging markets, typically. Today we'll be taking a look at their ETF uh, about Gene Revolution or one specific company that they uh, have been aggressively adding into. And that is EvoGene. As you can see in the last year, they have skyrocketed 186%. Although over the last five years, they do have a pretty poor looking track record. Um, they do have a very small market cap of 167 million, and they are relatively a newer company founded in just 1999. Uh, so if you look here, uh, EvoGene, they pride themselves on their computer biology technology. Uh, so they use AI and uh, their data to help manufacture um, in biology. Uh, they have three fields, which is industrial applications, their human health, and their agricultural uh, field. And they do have a couple subsidiaries uh, that break off into more specific uh, markets, and I will get into that in a little bit. Um, but I, I will link their investors' relations page down below. I highly recommend just taking a look at through uh, these financial reports. Uh, it is an interesting company, I will give you that, cutting edge, and I do see a big future for it, but again, it is a penny stock, essentially, a very, basically a micro cap company, so there is a lot of risk involved. Um, so, as, as you can see here, uh, this is just a little bit more, um, talking about their technology and their approach in life sciences and how they utilize data. This is an article that I uh, came across. It is a pretty good read. It'll only take you a couple minutes. Um, I will link this one down below as well. Uh, but as you can see here, just by the title, uh, they announced $10 million uh, in equity-led uh, investment by ARK Investments. Um, so ARK Investments does back this company, of course, by them investing in it. Um, and this is another uh, article that's actually on ARK Invest that I will also link below. Um, but it just highlights EvoGene. Um, and as it states, EvoGene allows companies to predict the growth impact of more than 4,000 genes use, uh, used singly or in a combination. Uh, desirable seeds can be produced and validated, or validate with much more precision and at much lower cost uh it does mention a couple other companies in here but i did want to highlight how they do talk about evogene um and i did mention earlier how they are in their gene uh, revolution uh etf uh this is just a little bit about it um they as you can see they focus on dna sequencing gene editing gene therapy ag bio targeted therapeutics and molecular diagnostics uh, and of course the portfolio manager is Catherine Wood um, but as we take a look uh, further into this ETF uh, it's it's uh, net assets are 2.3 billion and uh, I just went down to this fund holding uh, and I looked through it and of course, EvoGene is a very small company, so they have a smaller position in comparison to their overall ETF. It would be uh, quite cool to look through all these, although I am just focusing on EvoGene today. Uh, it only makes up 0.28%, uh, and they have about 4.6 uh, million shares, equivalent to about $21.5 million, uh, as you can see here. Um, and taking a look at one of their subsidiaries, this is a cannabis company, and they are based in Israel right now. Um, and they have just gotten a couple um, uh, thumbs up on them producing uh, and selling cannabis products. Um, I will uh, highly recommend you guys review uh, this company before. Uh, it is quite interesting. Um, and they are trying to break into the American markets, saying how they should be selling uh, in about 2022. So it will take some time. Although uh, EvoGene as a company right now is in a growth phase, so they have been just eating away at their cash supplies. 
thus uh, basically supporting their last five years uh, in their downtrend just because their revenues have gone down and they have really tried to scale up. Uh, if you look at their other subsidiary that I want to uh, take a look at, Biomedica, um, these guys uh, try to engineer and develop um, different medicines that uh, attack tumors, and they have had some pretty good success with um, some st studies showing how it is very effective, and they don't have a set date on... Um, when they're going to release this, although they are uh, actively working on trying to make a profit from this once it is fully uh, ready to go. Um, so Evogene, I think, is a very interesting company just for the simple fact how they are so diversified with their subsidiary. So if one does fail, uh, the entire company doesn't fail. Um, and of course, ARK Invest has been notorious for seeking out these very uh, disruptive uh, companies and being very successful at that. I would definitely keep an eye um, and put this on my watch list to see where it goes and of course keep up with their um, subsidiaries and different patents and uh, licensing about selling because once these subsidiaries and of course Evogene as a company themselves get all the thumbs up they will be able to make a lot of cash and quickly um, and have massive cash flows hopefully although they do need a cash to keep on burning for the time being to continue to scale and of course finish up uh, these certain um, innovations such as the medicines and just be able to outlast um, until they can start making a profit on it uh, now I highly recommend you guys looking into this uh, further, uh, looking at their financials. It is a high risk uh, investment, especially with them being so little and ba basically being a micro cap company. Um, but if you uh, enjoyed this video, I would really appreciate a thumbs up for the YouTube algorithms and hit that sub uh, down below. It really helps out the small channels like mine. And uh, until next time, take it easy.